So somebody has messed up really bad. Guys, my apologies for the impromptu recording location. We are inside my truck right now, parked in a parking lot because I got this information while I was driving. I don't have time to run home to record a video, so here we are. Let's jump into things. Someone messed up really bad. Uh, Harley dealership, I won't put them on blast. I'm a thousand percent sure Harley Davidson Corporate has already caught wind and will take action accordingly. Now, for those that are wondering what might happen, it could be as major as pulling their franchise or as minor as, you know, kind of fining them or, you know, restricting them from getting certain incentives, what have you. But the bike that leaked is the 2023 Freewheeler model. Now, really quickly, before I throw the pictures up on the screen that leaked, I want to talk about an anonymous email that I was sent um, with speculation that the freewheeler was going to have a fairing. Most people speculated the road glide fairing and I had heard this before the anonymous email came through. Uh, the person that emailed me said that they thought it could even have the lowrider ST fairing. I didn't think that was the case. I think Harley will really protect that lowrider ST fairing and it will only be for that bike. I could be wrong, but that's just my gut feeling. But I was skeptical that the bike would come with a fairing at all and that's because on the color chart, as you see in the picture right here, they still called the model the FLRT. Now, in my opinion, if Harley Davidson was going to make such a significant change as putting a fairing on a uh, previously non-fairing bike, they would change the name. And that's just my opinion. So without further ado, here is your 2023 Freewheeler model. Now, I did know for sure that it was blacked out. Um, just some information that I had access to uh, showed a black trim option. Uh, it literally just said trim and black. The Freewheeler has not come in the black trim option. So I knew that was gonna be something new that Harley was gonna do. Now, looking at these pictures, we know there is a black trim option. We know the three colors that it's coming in and we know it got a huge upgrade in the way of wheels. I'm a big, big fan of the wheels Harley put on the bike this year. And I see a bunch of people with trikes switching over to these wheels because they do look so good. We did also see on their website starting at $29,999. So we do know the starting price colors will obviously add more. Uh, black trim typically in the past has cost more. So I would expect that to be the case. Now, when I looked at the color options on the website, I did not see a photo of one with the black trim, but as you see in the pictures that are kind of on the headline of the website, when you click on the trike tab, you can see there is a blacked out option. My question to you, do these changes make the freewheeler any more appealing for trike riders? In my personal experience, I have seen most people just upgrade themselves to the tri-glide, for the infotainment, the fairing, the extra storage, it's just a better long distance bike for not that much more money when you compare what you're getting. So does this help this bike out or do you think Harley should have gone through and put the fairing on this bike? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below and I'll catch you guys in the next video.